Bubble ASM4 Pico CTFD 899A return. Submit the flag as a hexadecimal value starting with 0x. Won't be in the normal flag format found here. Okay, let's take a look. Whoa, that looks really long. Um, I don't think I feel like doing that. So here's what we'll do instead. I'm gonna just run it and let the computer figure this out for me. So first I'm gonna to need to put this in some sort of format that NASM will understand. Um, is it dot section text global as in four something like this? We'll need to get rid of all these things, but I need some of these labels. So we'll do a global search in place. So I'm going to look for less than plus, and I'm going to get a number. And I'm going to remember that. So I'm going to use this backslash parenthesis so I can remember what the number is, and then it's a bunch of digits. Followed by that, and I'll replace that with as in four underscore and the number that I matched. All right, so that looks pretty good. Um, all right, we got all these pointers. I need to get rid of all that. Okay, that'll help. Now I have these jumps, which I'll need to replace with the labels that I created. Hopefully there won't be too many of those. Um, test.s and how do I tell it's 32 bits oh yeah okay so now it's on dash of 32 in terms of the final local label before any None. Okay, let's take a look here. NASM file. So tutorial. Your first program. Okay, so I need to say my global first and then my section. Global first, then section. Okay, let's try this again. Test.s. Okay. Oh. Section dot text. Great. Now I just need a little C program. zero X and then we just need to call as in four with the value I specified okay GCC in 32 as in four we need as in four dot C and test dot O Couple warnings, that should be okay. And there's my answer, 0x23e. Bam, and there's the points.